I'm very surprised that they still have Zombie Morale in Warzone. In yesterday's video, I did actually show a tweet from Call of Duty that said Zombie Morale was supposed to be going away yesterday. But hey man, since it's still here, I might as well play it one final time. Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to some more Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So in this video, I will be playing Zombie Morale. I am actually very surprised that Zombie Morale is still in Warzone, especially since all the Halloween stuff is gone and everything. I thought it would have been gone then. It kind of sucks that I can't really work on the ramp in today's video because I did say in yesterday's video, if you guys haven't seen it, make sure you guys go check it out. I did say that I was actually supposed to be working towards a reptile and everything, but I thought Zombie Morale wasn't actually supposed to be in Warzone today, so I thought I might as well just play it one final time. But hopefully in tomorrow's video, I should be working on the RAM, guys. But I reckon they just kept Zombie Morale in just because a lot of people did enjoy it, and a lot of people reckon it is the best Warzone game mode that they've dropped. But anyways, guys, before I hop into Zombie Morale for one final time, if you guys could please give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel to show your support. I appreciate all of it. Make sure you guys subscribe and turn on the bell notifications for some more Call of Duty content like this. But anyways, guys, let's hop right into it. One eternity later. Thank goodness I'm finally in a lobby, dude. You guys have no idea how long it took for me to find a lobby. I don't understand why. I joined like a 200 plus ping lobby and it took me like 10 minutes to find one. That is just ridiculous, dude. But I'm so glad I finally found a zombie route lobby. I'm definitely going to miss a zombie route when it goes, dude. It is like the best game mode that Call of Duty has dropped in Warzone. I mean, I didn't really play it a lot. I only really played it for the trick or treat event to actually try and get the pumpkin punisher blueprint. And then after that, I really didn't play it, but it's still such a fun game mode, dude. The fact that you don't actually have to go to the gulag, you just drop instantly back in as a zombie, and you get like really cool superpowers as a zombie. You get like a gas grenade, EMP, and like a super jump. I'm gonna miss that, dude. But the fact that it took like 10 minutes for me to find this 200 plus ping lobby, that is insane, dude. I thought a lot more people would be playing Zombie Rail. This dude just flopped in front of me. What the heck? <laughs> Honestly, I don't really care how long I'm in the Zombie Rail game for, guys. Like, it has taken so long to find a lobby, and I do not want to go through that again. I'm just lucky I even found a lobby, dude. Uh, I'm definitely gonna miss these nighttime maps as well. I'm actually very surprised that they're not gonna bring the nighttime maps back more. Like, I actually really do like the nighttime maps. It just makes it harder for you to find people. It just makes it super fun that way. Like, it definitely makes it feel like a horror movie, dude. But I mean, with Cold War, the Cold War preloads actually have started. I did say in yesterday's video that they were meant to start today and they actually have. Like, that's probably why I joined such a laggy lobby, just because I have so many things downloaded for Cold War. Like, I have all the campaign, multiplayer, and zombie stuff downloading. I'm pretty sure it takes up just just under 100 gigabytes, which is honestly super painful. But I mean, hey man, anything for Cold War. <laughs> like, I honestly can't tell you guys how excited I am for Cold War. Like, I'm super excited for that mastery camera grind. Like, that's the only thing I can actually think of. I still really hope it is just straight headshots because if it's anything like mounting or 3cc no scopes or sliding kills or something, I'm in for a hell of a ride, dude. Okay, that's not good for me, dude. I at least I get to become a zombie though. That's the main part of the zombie out mode. You are a zombie. Kill humans and eat them. Oh man, I'm gonna miss seeing that. Oh, that's a fellow zombie, dude. Ah, oh. the only thing as a zombie is that if I see someone from far away, I know I can't. Act what? How did he get me, dude? Now I'm stuck spectating people. I was just gonna say, dude, as a zombie, if I see someone from a distance, I know I can't get them. Good thing is that my teammate has enough weight to buy me back. Dude, that was ridiculous. I was around that corner before that dude shot me, though. I mean, I'm not waiting in another zombie rail lobby, though, because that took forever last time. But I am actually still very surprised zombie rail is still around. Like I said earlier in this video, I reckon only kept it just because a lot of people do actually enjoy it. It's one of the best Warzone game modes that Call of Duty has released. This dude's having a hard time getting that syringe up there, dude. That that is embarrassing. <laughs> My teammate can still buy me back, dude. He has 10,000 plus, but I guess I'm just not that important to him. <laughs> you know, I'm just ping a buy station. You guys want a buy station right there? I mean, the scary thing about zombie rail as well is that if you're trapped in a room and the zombie comes at you, you are screwed. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just so disappointed that I died super early. Like, I don't understand, dude. This is like the early zombies route gameplay I'm gonna get before my final game on zombies rail. This is so disappointing for me, dude. Man, good thing is that my teammates are still alive. I can still come back. Oh man, I better hope this dude actually gets a second vial, comes back and actually buys me back. But this gets me thinking about how Cold War Warzone will be, dude. Like how I feel and everything. I don't know if they're going to change like the whole mechanics of it. I got a feeling Warzone will stay like this, but just have like a different map. And of course, the guns from Cold War will be coming in. But going from Warzone to multiplayer and going back and forth, I have heard that Warzone will be way different to Cold War multiplayer. So just getting used to those mechanics, everything will be super weird. Bro, he brought back the teammate and not me? Oh my god, dude. I see how it is, man. I hope the zombie kills him. 
Thank you. Thank you, zombie. You made him pay for his mistakes. But I mean, if Warzone does play like this and Cold War plays like how it did in the beta, then of course, going back and forth between the two and getting used to it's gonna be so weird. Just because Cold War, like the sliding is so much different and the gameplay, and then hopping back here, which is basically modern warfare, like tactical sprinting and everything, so it'll be super weird. I've spent like half of this video just watching my teammates. They've just been becoming zombies, coming back to life, then becoming zombies again, dude. I mean, hey, dude, at least this doesn't mean I have to freak out about someone trying to snipe me out of nowhere. At least in this game, you don't get that Warzone anxiety of getting like one shot by a sniper from the most ridiculous angle. Like I say every time I play Warzone, dude, I always think that's gonna happen. I always think someone's gonna hit some sort of trick shot on me and then send me to the gulag and then I'm gonna get outplayed 1v1. And I really hope this dude's gonna go buy me back, dude. Yes! Oh, thank you, teammate. You brought me back. Oh, you learned from your mistake about buying the other back, dude. You are human again. All right, I need to find some guns, dude. I need to actually make the most of this. Hopefully no one drops in on me and I'm already getting shot right off the bat. That's good, dude. That's great. Oh, I have to stuff from when I was a human before. I forgot that's how it worked. I mean, I guess the good thing is that if I do die now, I can become a zombie again. And hopefully when I'm a zombie, I can do what my teammates do and just grab two files super duper easy. I'm so happy I actually get to play this dude and I don't have to watch my teammates anymore. Teammates, we need to move. We have like 10 seconds left before the zone closes in and the zone's over here. So we need to go, dude. They say that zombies are more powerful than the gas and I don't want to be there to find out. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my teammates are trying to hug the circle. It'd be very surprising if this is how I win my first war zone game, dude. I don't think so because teammates going down left, right and center. Oh, let's go, dude. Oh, gosh. Now the zombies are going to be dropping back in from the people that we killed. They're going to be trying to kill us, dude. Oh, I'm not ready for this. Dude, the fact that you can hear the zombies as well is just scary. Dude, this is literally like a horror movie. I forgot how scary the zombie morale is, dude. Honestly, dude, anytime I play Warzone, no matter what game mode it is, I really just try to focus and everything. Ah! Oh, he's over there. No, no, please don't let me. Please don't let me die. Please don't let me die. He's over there. He's over there, please. Oh my God, dude, okay. At least I get to come back as a zombie now. Oh, and I get to drop straight down. Let's actually kill this dude that killed me. Oh my God, dude. Bro, I never do well as a zombie. I don't understand. Well, now I'm back to spectating. I'm actually very surprised. My team could win this just by me dying all the time. But every time I play Warzone, dude, if I'm not spectating, I always try super hard for some reason, no matter what game mode. Like I always just have to listen, dude. I'm definitely not one of those people that just listen to every single movement. Like if you open a door like 200 meters one way or something and just know where you are. But I definitely try to focus on when I do play Warzone. I mean, if my teammates win this, dude, that gives me my first Warzone win, I'll be happy. <laughs> and the fact that it took like 10 minutes to get into this lobby and I thought it wasn't actually going to get enough footage to show you guys. I'm actually very happy with how this is going so far. I mean, my teammate definitely has enough cash, so hopefully he can buy me back. And I think that's what he's going to do. Yes. Oh my God, I love this dude now. He brought me back two times in a row. I just don't like it because now everyone's going to be becoming a zombie now. And I have really bad guns. All right, we need to actually get these vials and become human again, dude. Because that's the only way we can win. Good thing is that as zombies, you don't take damage in the gas. Come here, boy. <laughs> This just makes me realize how fun this game mode is, but also how stressful it is now that we're getting down to like the final people. I have not been playing well this game. I will let you guys know that and you guys have seen it. I right, see dude, now I don't even know where I'm dying from. Like this is that Warzone anxiety. He's hiding in a bush. I can definitely see how the tide can turn for who's gonna win, who's gonna lose, dude. Ah, no, the zombies, dude. Oh, the zombies. Oh my God, dude. This is hectic already. I'm very surprised that we haven't been eliminated yet. Oh no, we're all zombies. We're gonna lose. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes, I'm back. Let's go, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. I'm pretty sure we're the final three people. Me, my teammate, and some other dude. No, 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 no. Oh, let's go, dude. Ooh, I didn't know think I was going to be getting that. Oh, my God. I actually didn't know that he was the final dude. Oh, my God. Let's go, dude. That's my first Warzone victory. Man, I thought this game was going to be so bad because I died right off the bat super quickly. Oh, my goodness. The fact that I got a win with randoms, that's crazy, dude. Oh, my God. The fact that I got a Warzone victory in my final Zombie Route game is insane, dude. Damn. Oh, my God. I don't even know what to feel. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You placed first. Damn right I placed first, dude. Oh man, that's so sick. So that was Zombo Royale for one final time, guys. And oh my goodness, the way it ended, I could not have thought of anything better, dude. Like honestly, I played that game so bad and so terribly, but the fact that my team stayed in there and I actually got the final kill, that's crazy, dude. And that's my first Warzone victory. I'm pretty sure I got that calling card that you do get from actually getting a Warzone victory. I got this last one standing calling card and dude, oh my God, that was crazy. I actually didn't even think that I was gonna win that. I'm just lost for words, dude. 
dude. Like, oh my god. Definitely gonna miss Zombie Rao. Definitely one of the most fun game modes that Call of Duty dropped in Warzone. But I'm just surprised that it's been around for this long after the Halloween event, dude. I thought all the Halloween stuff was gonna go when it ended. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you did, please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel to show your support. I appreciate all of it. Make sure you guys subscribe and turn on the bell notifications for some more Call of Duty content like this. But again, thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. See you all in the next one.